Hey everyone, Joe Dickinson here from Vintage King. Today we're going to be talking about the five biggest changes to the most recent update of Pro Tools. Let's start with the most important one first. Anytime you previously moved tracks, changed plugins, anything like that, you'd end up with a glitch and it would stop you in your tracks. That doesn't happen anymore. You're able to move, create new tracks, anything like that, and it does not stop. This is a much needed update and will help to keep the creativity flowing while you're mixing and editing in the studio. Pro Tools users previously only had 256 tracks per project, but with the latest update, that number has increased significantly. Pro Tools Ultimate users can create massive sessions up to 384 simultaneous audio tracks with just the software alone. You can have up to 768 voices by adding Pro Tools HGX cards, or have its brand new native voice packs. Each of these new voice packs feature 128 extra voices per pack, now audio tracks aren't the only thing getting an upgrade here. You are now able to use up to 1024 MIDI channels. That's twice the previous update. You can use the virtual instruments included with Pro Tools or any of your own third party ones and not have to worry about hitting the limit and having to bounce out to stems. With this update to workflow, you can now name your channels much, much quicker. Within the first window of creating channels, you can now name them from the same window saving you that little bit more time to focus on what's really important. But it's not just Pro Tools Ultimate and Pro Tools users that are seeing the benefits of this update. Pro Tools First users can now save an unlimited number of sessions on their local hard drive and upload three to the cloud for collaboration at any time. If you have any further questions, feel free to visit us online at finishking.com or reach out to your audio consultant.